Hey, how's it going? This is Mr. Hernandez, and I'm going to help you with this one uh, problem on this assignment. Um, the first thing you want to notice is that you're going to be given um, this red um, graph, and you need to make it match the dotted line. And so as you click through these, you'll um, have to, and this one's kind of tricky because you have to um, kind of drag it up a little bit to see it. Um, but yeah, every single problem is going to be you having to match um, the graph. And so the question will be, which way do you got to move it? And in this case, um, this red graph is always going to be at the origin, at zero. And then this graph that you have to match um, looks like it moves to the left one, the vertex. And so now we're, the question is, where do we put the one? And so if I put plus one, um, oops. If I put plus one, notice that it shifted the red graph up one because this is uh, not under the square root, so it is k, which moves it up or down. Again, if I make it minus one, it moves it down. But in order for it to move left and right, I have to make sure that I add or subtract um, under the square root. And so notice that um, if I if I have my cursor um, right here, it's outside the square root. But if I have my cursor blinking right next to the x under the square root, and I put minus 1, uh, then you can see it moves it left and right. Now, um, remember, when it's the h and it's under the square root with the x, it's the opposite. And so minus 1 actually moves it right 1. But if we want to move it to the left 1, uh, we're going to have to go ahead and add 1. And there it is. That's the match. And so you're going to go through each of these slides and basically get the red curve to match right onto the dotted line. Now, in this case, this one's done, so you can move on. But in other ones, you're going to need to make this um, curve like maybe steeper or lower. And in order to do that, you will have to change the number in front of the uh, square root symbol, which is your A. And A is the slope. And so if I make A negative, it flips it upside down. Um, if I make A uh, greater than 1, it makes it go um, steeper, and so you might need to do that. And if you need to make it go lower, you're going to make it less than 1, not negative, because you don't want to flip it upside down. But if you want to make it steeper, like going right here, you're going to have to make it less than 1, but greater than 0. So I try like a decimal, like 0 0.9, 0 0.8, 0 0.7, and so on. And so um, that's it. That's this one example that I showed you how to move it left, right, up, down. And then in this case, um, you might need to flip it upside down or make it um, uh, steeper or, or lower. Okay, good luck.